Yo, what is up everybody? Who is ready to mess around with this most feared promo? We got a couple of the players, not too many, but one of the players we have is the 9 foot tall, 99 overall Brian Dawkins. Look at him back there. We're going to be using with Dawkins all game long, seeing we can make some plays covering the middle of the field right there. And part of the problem is when somebody sees a 9 foot tall player, they're not even going to try to test them, so... You know, people left me alone for the most part as we get a sack on third down. Return to punt here with most feared John Brown. Whoop! John Brown breaking the tackle right there in open space. Whoop again! And John Brown out running everybody into the end zone. These most feared players, man, they are beasts when it comes to kick returns, punt returns, just getting them to the open field. You would think their big thing will be their height. I just love how much, like, how hard you can juke with these guys. Like, John Brown just jukes around so much of the field. Just with one simple little move. And we got a touchdown just like that. Like, when I'm doing soul challenges, like, John Brown is a beast when it comes to those returns. As we get some nice pressure right there, knocking Andrew Luck to his backside. And this time, my opponent thinks better of kicking it to John Brown. And check this shot out, man. Look at Joey Porter and Brian Dawkins again. I'm pretty sure Joey Porter is at least six feet tall. Looks like a midget. Absolute midget compared to Dawkins. He looks like an eight-year-old kid walking next to his dad. As you see, there is Hayward Bay. All our receivers are most feared players, including Terrell Pryor getting the catch right there. Most feared Pryor at the wide receiver position, making plays here. John Brown after his punt return touchdown, getting some catches and offense. Next play, I see Dre Archer wide open. That is the most feared Dre Archer as well, which has 99 speed. So why not get Dre Archer in the open field by running a screen? And unfortunately, he runs it down with free Bud Dupree, and that's going to bring up third down and two. But we're able to get the first down to John Brown. Right now, the offense is quicking. Vic is six for six. Oh, yeah. Most feared Vic on the field, by the way. Double spin move, carrying defenders to the one-yard line. That Mike Vic with 95 speed. Like, sometimes all you got to do is just come out and five wide and take off with that Vic. He's so big and elusive that, I mean, it really is more of a glitch than... A 99 overall Mike Vick, the one that's probably coming out in like February. So he lobs it up over Dawkins and gets it over Dawkins. But it's picked off by most feared Omar Bolden anyways as we throw it down the middle of the field to Terrell Pryor. I, I thought that was a catch Dawkins can make. Maybe it's because I was... um. Facing the receiver instead of the ball, but either way, Brashad Perriman is back on offense after we got the interception. Mike Vick still has not missed the pass yet, and that's going to continue maybe on the next play because right now we're going to have to take an incomplete, or actually a sack from Bud Dupree. I tried rolling out a little bit too much as Darius Hayward Bay gets the catch, and Hayward Bay can go all the way, but he won't go all the way. I felt like this game had a little bit of lag. It doesn't really show up, but I felt like it was a little bit laggy, and plus my opponent's name was Hacker. So, like, I wasn't trying to mess around, alright? I was trying to chew up a little bit of clock. So, that's what we did there. We killed, like, about maybe, like, a minute of time just by, um... Scoring the touchdown second down instead of scoring on the Hayward Bay catch. Eventually, Okoye punched it in. That's not a most feared Okoye, but Okoye still got 97 trucking. So, I'll run fullback dies with that man any day of the week as he runs a halfback toss. But that goes nowhere. Our defensive line is playing great. We don't really have too many players on the defensive line. And that was kind of a problem when I played. I didn't really realize. But that time, we sent five and Michael Kendricks came through. And now, John Brown with six seconds left. He punts it in the middle of the field. Whoop! That's a mistake because there goes John. John Brown again brought down this time at the 22 and that's going to end half we need to get a touchdown that player also was going into the second half and just couldn't get it done and now we're cheesing with Dre 99 speed I should have just circled all the way around the field instead of cutting it back like that instead we're just going to be brought down at the 15 as you guys see, like I said man it's not just like I don't care about lobbing it up to players I'm, I'll take off a of Vic we got lucky right here to get this recovery Darius Hayward Bay is the only guy amongst four Niners and somehow got that so we're very thankful for that as unfortunately um, screen pass was somehow covered up to freaking right tackle carry the blocker all the way to the screen pass for some reason here Terrell Pryor one on one got a step but most fear Vic just tosses that one out of bounds third down this one thing about Terrell Pryor he has like 50 route running so he did not run that post route properly and that's pretty much screwed up the drive but we're going for on fourth down we don't care and we are rewarded for our no shits given approach there goes Marcel Reese he just dropped the controller at that point you guys saw his player just stood still there and that made it easier for us to pick up some blocks and get in the end zone with Reese I mean it's the most fear promo at this point like, you really if you're gonna play the most fear promo you have to be okay with taking a loss all right because that's what this promo is all about like, it's just absolute madness. There is no, you know, best player wins kind of thing. It's just 
the most bullshit going on the most weird promo wins. And I'm okay with that, man. It's a big enough gimmick that it actually works for the weekend, you know? It's it's a fun... I, obviously, you can't play like this forever. He just missed a wide-open receiver in the middle of the field. Just threw a pick instead to Mike Harris. But yeah, if you're okay with just, you know, messing around, having fun, you don't care about your record, then you can take advantage of this promo and have fun. That's what I was doing. Thankfully, we're up 28 nothing. I really have not been playing too well. But plays like this are why we're up, Michael. Whoop! Vic, Vic to the outside. Can he go all the way? Oh, unfortunately, they say he stepped out at the two. That would have been one tremendous touchdown. But that's actually going to be the last play of the game. My opponent just got sick of his big Vic running around. He was sick of seeing nine-foot-tall Brian Dawkins that he couldn't figure out how to throw over. And he left. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for more Man 16 Ultimate Team. And I'll catch you guys with another Most Fear gameplay tonight. It's going to be a good one.